I closed my eyes. I closed my eyes to escape and dare then dare forget the chains that bind my present time and space. I close my eyes to reach and touch my deepened roots, where there to find that place where once was mine to be. I close my eyes and awaken to a morning rooster's cry that greets a new day's rising sun, where tobacco tits that wait to fill my native longing mouth with milk and trees that beckon me to climb where ripened fruits await my grass. I close my eyes. I close my eyes to scan the fields of sugar cane and coffee beans, to race across a sandy beach and leap into a sea so full of game for me to catch and eat, to eat a plate of green bananas, yuccas, and yams while Pork skin slowly spins its way to hardened crust. I close my eyes for an evening meal with rice and beans as the sun begins to set. I close my eyes to hear the crickets and coquis begin to serenade the moon as raindrops beat tin roots and the whistle of the ocean breeze fills the room with peace. I close my eyes. I close my eyes to ask Abuelo and Abuela why they let my parents move to where for me it all became no more than a place to close my eyes and dream. How misunderstood. How misunderstood my kicks and screams when first I came to be. To be an exiled toddler spawned on distant shores made steel and concrete cold. A sprouting child, confused, without guayabera shirts or palm hats. An angry man forced to make a clone-like stand without a machete in my hand. But I close my eyes. I close my eyes each night to dare escape to dare forget the chains that bind my present time and space. Yes, I close my eyes. I close my eyes to reach and touch my deepened roots, where there to find that place where once was mine to be, but now no more than a distant dream in deep. Now no more than but a distant dream in deep.